Oh, damn it, I'm dead. I'm dead as f Welcome back to Seven Days to Die with Epic Spire. It is the afternoon of day 45. I've finished organizing. I actually put everything up where they're supposed to go. I made another toolbox to uh, put the actual wrenches and stuff in because this was full. I think today what we're going to do is go back out here to the book house and that cracker book, see what I can get out of that place, and then come back and we will work on the second floor. Now I was thinking I might have already done that book house. So I, I know I uh, did a flash raid of a book house, a cheese raid. I don't know if that was that one because that was had to have been close to the uh, football field, right? It's one of these football fields I found. Had had a ah, uh, oh, you little bitch. You would have had me if you didn't make any noise. Stupid ass. Real zombies don't breathe. Zombie up. Yeah, let's hope that this isn't the one I've already been in. I do need more of these cabbages. That's what y'all get. Okay. Bookshelf. Definitely want goggles on. Already know it. Let's save it. Ooh, big boy. Thumb man. You get a thumb man. Nice. Alright, no. Alright. Yeah. Because the one I super rated, I checked this, and that's where I found my M60 schematic, so... Eight time scope. Machine gunner, I haven't read yet. Craft M60 machine gun. I already know how to do that. I found the schematic for that. Why is there a schematic and a handbook? Whatever. Still doesn't make any sense why there's a magazine and a schematic. If the mag all the magazine does is give you the schematic. SMG, kind of useless, but let's take it anyways. Oh damn it! Let's try. All right, I'll come back. Oh, I don't like you. I need to go to my uh, motorcycle and put stuff up real quick. Yeah, let's go do that before we go into the next room. Alright. Oh, no. Fuck y'all. Nice. Make sure I got everybody. Nobody sneaky sneak up on me. Nice, nice. Alright, let's see what we got. I think I have enough of those. I'll take that. Ranger's Guide to Archery, don't need it, but I'll read it. Completion, don't need that. That and that can scrap. Really not sure exactly what I was really expecting or looking for. Alright, cool. Crack a book. Let's do this.
Oh, you mother... Damn, dude. I just let y'all bust out and come at me. You ain't got shit on me. Oh, shit. Oh my god. No? Oh, you soften me up for Danny. That that ain't fair. Oh damn it, I'm dead. I'm dead as fuck. Come at me, bitch. That was that was way too close. Uh oh look, a treasure map, finally. Another one. You're useless. Take you though. Do I have any experience points to spend? I got one. Uh let's see what we can do with it. A healing factor, that's right. Alright, let's do this. Off this back door. Okay. No, I see a Danny. Of course, when I start looting, I'll just leave in the uh, good stuff and not the uh, piles of paper. Oh, no. oh fuck me. Oh, why am I hungry? Please stop doing that. I am not... I'm not made of bullets now. Come on. Do I have, I do have lemons too. I didn't eat any. I just put in my inventory. This is Jennifer's. Let's go ahead and read that and get that out of the inventory. We'll probably never do that. I have not seen a bear except for a zombie bear. And that doesn't count. So I'm not going to cancel the quest just in case I do find a bear. Oh yeah, I remember this. Okay. There should be a bunch of them hiding out down here. Am I, am I wrong? Is there not a bunch? Oh, fuck me. Hey, why are you just laying on the ground sleeping and shit? Awesome, let's uh crack this stuff open. Is this locked? Oh it is. We might get lucky. Alright, I said might, so don't hold that against me. Is this back in there? Okay, let's just break our way through. I don't feel like wasting a jailbreaker on one locked chest. So what I'm going to do is just, you know, I got 56 lock picks. Yeah, so let's just do this. There we go. Only used uh, three lockpicks. So that's good. Alright, so now we can uh, crack this stuff open. Ugh. That great. Got another point. Let's go ahead and put that into the last thing of uh, Iron Gut. Alright, well, I guess that's the end of this bullshit run. Didn't really find much. Uh, don't feed the bears challenge. Let's read it. Kill some bears. Some regular bears. Waste of space. I'm gonna I'm gonna just go up here and uh I don't wanna I don't wanna do that without an auger, actually, because that'll take forever. So I'm just gonna go back here. We can work on the uh the house for a bit and uh maybe next episode I'll dig that up with an auger. 
I was hoping to find some more bar brawling books so I can finish off that collection. Pretty awesome. Especially to be able to drink the beer without having that blurred effect, which is the only reason why I don't really drink it as much. Because I think it uh, kind of ruins for video quality anyways. All right, just emptied some stuff off, but I realized I need more storage. So let's make another storage chest here. Do uh, some boxes that I can just uh, place the extra stuff in. Uh, yeah, let's before I forget, I need bandages. I thought you needed aloe. So 52, 25, so 25 bandages. All right, that won't take long. All right, I'm going to start on the band, uh, first aid kits and then I'll uh, start working also on the uh, second floor. Oh, it's the chemistry station. God damn it. obviously the corner pieces continue to be columns now build the ramps to the corridor entrance and exit of the stairwells I'm going to have to bust this back out I thought I already replaced those I didn't know those were the still the curved pieces I had two augers I don't know if I already destroyed the other one for parts are yeah here's one do i have any gas for it yeah this whole thing should just look like this i can just put a block and then this and i need to get some uh cobblestone as well and then i think the rest of this is uh just normal I would like a big Viking Hall type style table. That's gonna be... I don't know how to do that. If I do this, we're gonna run into the problem of... We're gonna run into the problem that this is gonna have a different side texture. So when I paint it, it's, it's going to look weird. It's gonna be crisscrossed. Unless I find paint that is uniform. But I was wanting to do some type of wood grain could do a big old stone slab table that would look nice too but i'll have to take a look maybe this yeah all right i think this might work i want space here to be able to walk to three four, five All right, and in the middle, very middle can be, if this works, that would be nice. I don't think it's going to. It's look, it looks like it's going the other way. Let's, uh, I oh, don't know, it still goes this way. Now, I don't know why that looks like that. Can that be repainted? Okay. I mean, I, I don't want to paint it that color, but as long as I know that that can be painted, that'd be nice. This is set further back than I want, and it's going to look weird. Let's see if there's something else I can use. All right, I was going with this, so let's go with... Okay, well, that actually looks like it goes to that, so... Perfect. Yeah, it's going to be different. See, that's different. That's sideways, but I guess I did the right thing by choosing this grain. Yeah, because you can't tell that that's going a different direction. So that worked out. Because I'm thinking, you know, that's, you know, where your legs would be when you got the chair right there. If that makes sense. Yeah, see, that, that one goes the same way. That's weird. Nice. All right, I need to actually go measure where to put these support columns. One, two, three, four, 
five angle right angle one two three four five so along here the support columns need to be and that's where right where the chairs are if i made it wider though i could have put the support column like you know right there but we'll have to figure that out at a different times and stuff let's let's see what paint works best for the top do i want it to be marble hmm. i don't know I mean, all the good paint seems like if i use that i'm just overusing it but everything else don't seem to fit i was kind of hoping uh that marble would look a little bit better i mean i like the the way it looks it's just i don't think it'll be good for this table let's try the whole thing and see what it looks like damn it dang it it's way out there too I know there's a piece that I can't see. It's like right underneath there, but I can't see it, so I can't click on it. All right, and this can be like serving tables where the uh, the peasants that want to serve me, they can bring up the food, put it over here, and then you know, this is the council table where me and the the other rulers of this forgotten wasteland come together and talk about you know the best way to torture and kill Danny every time we see him. Oh, I wish I could paint a map on this. That would be nice. This could be like the war room, you know, then like have chess pieces that we can move around, like actually paint this map onto this. So I can come up here every day and be like, all right, today we're going to go over here, you know, stuff like that. Of course, that chimney is going to extend all the way up. The only thing left to do is put in the walls, find out exactly where I want to put work columns decide if i'm going to have to shrink the table a little bit yeah probably shrink it by one on all sides that way it'll just take up this space right here let's just see what that looks like it'll be this big instead which is fine that way i can have the support columns going down here because the third floor is going to have to be supported all the way to bed bedrock because i don't want this thing collapsing on me especially when i get to the 20th floor because this is going to be say it with me an epic spire that goes all the way up to the clouds that way i can jump off of it but each floor is going to look about the same and by that i mean they're going to have all shoots like this that go in the inside's going to be different like that floor is going to be like a, a dining hall i don't really know what the third floor is going to look like just probably extra storage that is just extra junk stuff that doesn't deserve to be put in store i mean you know in like museum style uh future storage but stuff that i can still have a wall of armor and just put like all the extra armor whether it's tier six or not in there at some point because the third floor is probably going to be where all the turrets are now that's going to surround this place there's going to probably be cameras on each side going to be a siren on there on each side probably at some point along the way i might actually start putting the garden along the outside you know like overhang i don't know how to explain it it's kind of in my head but not drawn out so we'll get we'll see where we are when we get there all right, so I'm just going to go ahead and paint. If you liked this episode, smash that like button like it's Danny's face. Tickle that subscribe button for me. And start a conversation in the uh, comment section of this video. Let me know everything that uh, you want to see in future series. And the future of this series, which is uh, going strong. Like I said earlier, only four more levels to go. And I'll be able to proceed with the next phase of the legacy. I'm actually surprised I haven't died so far. Yeah, see y'all in the next episode. Peace. Yes.